hi everyone welcome to my channel and today's video i'll be showing you how to make a linen spray just as i mentioned in the previous video about bed styling that the, the linen spray that i was using to spray on my bed and in case you're new here i'm kairiki clemens and on this channel we do interior design and lifestyle videos please subscribe like and share this video so here are the things that we'll be using to make the DIY linen spray and you'll need a spray bottle then you'll need a measuring a measuring would i call it a measuring cup yeah then you need alcohol of your own choice make sure you can stand the order i used this one because it's what we have in the house right now then you need down i love this downy when it comes to making linen spray because it has a it doesn't have a strong scent as compared to the others but i like the others for other things like laundry but yeah that's it so the next thing we'll be using this water it's just water from the tap and without much further ado let's get into the video so we'll start with alcohol and i measure i'll measure 10 ml of it So make sure you don't use a lot since alcohol has some odor and probably you can't stand it the purpose of alcohol is to give the spray disinfectant properties also for the down it helps in reducing wrinkles on fabric fights odors and refreshes the fabric and you don't have to use down if you have the essential oils you can also use them but for my case because i don't have the essential oils that's why i'm using downy it's a DIY, it's a budget friendly, remember? So we put our alcohol, our 10 ml alcohol in our spray bottle. So the next thing that I do, I use downy. And as I said, I like this downy since it doesn't have a strong scent. So I measure a half. Like you see where these, these like Mahali, Mini Mefika, that's where I, I make sure my downy is at. Since I'm not using a lot, I usually make this linen spray and I make sure that it lasts about two or at most three weeks. I don't like making a lot because over time it, it loses its scent. So we add downy. So we mix it a little bit before we add water. So for the water, you can add according to your bottle, you can add water of your choice. Like if you want to make a lot, you can add the ingredients. But since my bottle is small and I just want it to last two or at most three weeks, I'll not be using a lot. So I add my water and make sure when you're adding water, you leave enough space to shake your foot so that when you shake your ingredients, they'll be able to mix up. Okay. So we add water and don't fill it up. That's what I was trying to say. And so you, you, you leave room to shake these things together. So mix up before you use the linen spray after now after you've made the linen spray and you're using it on another, another day make sure you shake it well before you use it so that the ingredients will mix up together so that's what i'm doing here this is how i make the linen spray it smells so good as you can see yeah, and that's it so this is our end product this is, we have a brand new linen spray you, and the good thing about down is it's affordable we have the small sachets such, such at the shop that goes for around i think 30 bob if i'm not 30 shillings if i'm not wrong so you have no excuse of making yourself a linen spray it, it also adds up as a room freshener you can you can use it on your curtains on your bed or your coach and where you feel like you need it so I hope you've learned something from this video. Please subscribe, like and share this video. And until the next 
video guys bye